All right, Midnight Run crew, what's going on? <laughs> We're in the shop working on the Smurf truck, and I want to make this video. This is just going to be probably a quick one because um, I wanted to show this, of course, the, the Smurf truck. Um, got the headers on. Um, I will put the brand of the headers um, in the description area there and stuff on it. So, um, But I got the headers on. I got the down pipes, the part of the exhaust. So I got an H pipe um, sticking in back behind there. Um, dumps out to, where does it dump out to, actually? Oh, it doesn't even go past the cab, so. There it is, so you can see one tip. There's the other tip back there, so we have to put mufflers and stuff onto it, but, so right now it's just um, straight pipe with an H pipe coming off of the header, so uh, driver's side, this is the passenger side one, so you can see the clearance between the shock and stuff, and there's the down pipe comes down through there, gets away from the transmission nicely, so that fits uh, pretty decently, it's kind of a, pain in the ass and stuff but it's in there um okay so anyway the important part is the driver's side here um so these actually are for the mustang um i don't remember what the year is going to be in the description onto it but it actually has the egr um port on there if you want to um these headers are kind of a pain in the ass and the fact that uh, passenger side is like this the ball what the hell is this the ball flange style um, whereas the dry or the passenger side is just the flat style flange so um, yeah you have to have two different styles and the freaking bolts they give you um, for it and that's the thing too is this is the Mustang which I guess I'll put the link for that too or I guess I will in case you want to get them but I had to get the down pipes too with it because of this weird ass difference um, on this side versus the other side with, with being that ball style the other one being a flat flange and stuff so I had to get the um, downpipe section for these ones so I can get it bolted up and stuff onto it. So, and I'll either cut that and weld that EGR or just plug it because, of course, with the Holly Terminator kit, there's no EGR. Anyway, this video is for this right here. So these headers I bought, like, as I said, I think video before, like five different ones, the longs and everything else stuff. This is the only ones that fit um, that seem to clear everything, especially the steering would actually come through. So the cab is back in the place, um, and then there's the steering. So here is um, all the way to the right. Uh, uh. And then this is, come on, all the way to the left. So as you see, no binding happening on that at all. It's swinging past that um, with no problem. So yeah, rocking and rolling. So yeah, so with the, whether you do it like this or the linkage kit, it should clear just fine with it. So that's what I'm gonna make. So there it is, later guys.